My name is Eric Losevich. I'm the lead test engineer for the vibration room at uh, the GM lab. Uh, the room we're in right now is the vibration room for the Global Battery Systems Lab where we test all our battery packs on this system here, which is the vibration shaker. Um, we have full capability for not only vibration, but power cycling and temperature cycling as well. Basically, we can test the battery exactly like it is in the vehicle. You can shake it like you're running down a road. This system is designed specifically to try to wear out a pack with vibration. You're trying to slowly stress your materials over time um, versus like a big impact where you're just trying to see if things snap and break. It's kind of like a paper clip, right? Um, in this case, you're not trying to take two pliers and just rip the paper clip apart. You're trying to take really small forces and just over time see if anything snaps. And the idea behind this test is to have no failures throughout the test. What happens in the vehicle when you're driving is the battery is actually pushing and pulling power in and out of it. And that's what we do with the big cycler that it's hooked up to. So that activates the chemistry inside of the battery, um, just like it would in the vehicle. The other thing we try to do is, you see the big thermal chamber around here, is to make the battery pack go through high temp, low temps, just like it would in the real world, you know. Down, you know, cold like it's in Canada, hot like it's in Phoenix. Um, different humidity levels. In the orientation it is now, it'll be shaking for 16 hours, um, running thermal cycles on top of it. We're the only lab that we know of in the world that can do all three components of this testing, the shaking, the, the power cycling, and the thermal cycling on a system this big. <laughs>